Yeah, so welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody is doing well. And in today's video, I thought we'd have a look at fixing this SG-003A here and see what's gone wrong with the connection jack. Um, see in a previous video when I was doing some testing work with this, uh, this blue jack here has become loose. And you can actually, uh, not sure how well, let's uh, zoom in, not that way. Hopefully you can see uh, the jack is moving around a lot in there. I've not noticed any problems with the connection, the unit carries on working, um, but obviously depending on how the connection is made onto the PCB with the jack, uh, the moving, or I should say plugging in and unplugging leads from the jack probably will be putting stress onto the connection, which will not be very good and would lead to a failure sooner or later. So I thought we'd just have a quick look and see if we can fix it. And I'm not sure what the connection arrangement is, but we'll find out very soon. Now, there's just four screws in the corner of these units to uh, remove them. There we go. And then the battery pack is glued onto the back of the case, or double-sided tape, I think. So we can plug him and remove him out of the way. And then we are inside, and there's our, oh, okay. There's our loose jack just there. Uh, so it is just a body. And it looks like the connection is on a ring underneath. Let's just uh, spin that off. Okay, so there's our jack that's come loose. Uh, if we take you in closer, uh, hopefully see there, there's this uh, collar on the inside that the jack goes through, that's soldered onto the PCB, and then it goes through there, then the nut just clamps it up against it. Um, which is quite a good connection methodology really. There'll certainly be no strain on the PCB with that, even though it's come loose. Um, but I would have expected the unit to have uh, not worked so well, I guess. Otherwise, the uh, connection won't be very good onto that uh, nut. That's, that's kind of making the connection onto the ring, isn't it? So, yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's see if we've got a spanner that fits. Might be. I think it's going to be too small. Yeah, it's going to be pliers. Can't be helped. Uh, so we will try again with our jack. Yeah, it's all tight now. Beautiful. That's a nice, easy fix, isn't it? So yeah, future knowledge. Doesn't really matter if they uh, do become loose. It's not the end of the world. It's a dead easy job just to tighten them up. So I'm pretty happy with that. I've been along the uh, the others as well and just make sure that they are all tight. That should be okay now. We'll see how we get on. So there you go. All nicely back together now. I'll screw the case back on. And a nice easy fix, which is what we like. So, that'll be it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you found it useful. And I'll see you again in the next one.